Listen, the best way to my Uncle Paulie's heart is through his rib cage with a meat cleaver. Failing that, you screw up his distribution and let the Chicago people collect on him. Now, I've been all over town picking up Paulie's drug money from his street peddlers, but I've never been to Dutch Oven Harry's. Would a moose have sex with me if I gave it $10 million? Well, that's a lot of money. So, would it? Well, I guess it would depend on the moose. If it was a genetically altered moose with the brain power equal to a human and capable of speech, I'd have to say yes. Okay. And where would I find such horny, naughty mooses? Hmm. Sweden, most likely. And everybody knows that the Swedes are open-minded when it comes to sex. Cross-species sex, too, I'm sure. Yeah, those filthy Swedes. God bless them. What say you slip me a couple of bucks, eh? Huh? I gotta take a train. Say, you got any liquor on you? Sorry, pal. I'm dry. Hey, you know Dutch Oven Harry? Oh, you, you wanna get wired up? <laughs> you go by the side door and tell them old Matty Forehand sent you. If they ask, you say, hit me. And then they bring the really good shit. Now, now, you make sure not to point any guns in their general direction. I don't want to get caught in a crossfire. the password hit me I gotta see Dutch oven Harry come on in Harry ain't around you want something talk to Roach hey Bobby Harry wants you to do the clean run tonight what are you fucking crazy I got a date with that stripper Camille from the pink pony? The one with the... How am I ain't doing it? Hey, get a move on it, huh, pal? I got a hot date tonight with a couple of Gino's girls. I got everything, what do you need? I need Harry. Where is he? You got some nerve, kid. Hey, Roach. What's up, Harry? Just got a call from the boss. Someone's coming to pay us a visit. Oh. He's already here. Harry, you want me to bring out the hard liquor? Oh, Christ. Okay, Roach, you do that. I'm sure he needs a sh-
You're probably wondering who is this. Well, Roach took the evening off. I'm the new guy.
delicate torture of the body and soul. Uncle Paul is pretty much a scumbag. Not that anyone has the balls to tell him to his face. Paul, he took me out of an orphanage I lived in after my parents died. It's kind of like being rescued from a shark attack by a grizzly bear. The only reason he took me in was because he needed another hitman. We never did see eye to eye. to do or feel about it. All I know is that it's evil. Where are you? I'm at home, but I'm going by there right now to see if there's anything I can do to help. Jimmy's picking me up. Can we meet at Fulton Street by the exit to the orphanage? You can take the train from Canal and be at Fulton in a minute. I'll be there as soon as I can. Who says the subway is dangerous? Never sat in the back of a yellow cab, going the wrong way, at 90 miles an hour, through the Midtown Tunnel, with a guy who can't speak a lick of English, my buddy, Crazy Abdul. <laughs> 